Matt, first things first, can we just get your overall evaluation of what happened here? Was it a case of two points dropped or a point gain? No, I think it was a, a point gain, to be honest, because Dunfermline lost yesterday and Motherwell are a good team. They got beat narrowly by Rangers last, last week, but they're fighting for a, for a top four position, so for them to come here and, and get a draw, it was a, it was a good point for us. Although we were winning 1-0 with 10 minutes to go, they, we both scored two good goals, but it was a good point for us, I thought. How excited are you about next weekend now? All, all eyes on that Cup semi-final and your first trip to Hamden. Yeah, and no, obviously any any semi-final in the cup is going to be a big occasion for us, especially seeing as we haven't we haven't won it in a hundred years. So obviously it's a good chance for us to get into the final. So no, I think everybody's looking forward to it massively. How have you settled into Hibbs' life as well, having moved up in January? Yeah, I settled in. I settled in fine. I, th I settled in decently at the start, and then it kind of felt a bit hung, hung, uh, wolves sick, if you put it that way. As in, I was thinking I wanted to go back in that and just fight my way through. But I've settled in again and. Uh, and I'm happy, it's only a month left now, so if, uh, I'm happy now where I am. Obviously, you set up one of Gary O'Connor's goals last week at Inverness. Do you feel that you're kind of adding that aspect to your game? Well, I think that's, I think that's the main part of my game is going forward, really, but I haven't really been able to express myself doing that so far because we've kind of been on, under the cosh for m most of the, the games that we've played. But last week, we got a chance to do it, and luckily, we set up one of the goals and stuff like that. But even, t even today, I was kind of going, but I was only able to get halfway before it's broken down. Or, or we've set up a chance. So, yeah, I think that's one of the main parts of my game is just haven't been able to express it so much. Well, so you've played at right-back, centre-half during your time here at Hibs so far. Right-back, is that your preferred choice? Yeah, right-back's my preferred choice. Centre-back is a bit, uh, a little bit alien to me at the moment, but obviously if the more games you play there, the, the more used to it you get. And what's the latest with regards to uh, information that you've received from Wolves? Obviously, a change of manager there. Uh, what's your situation looking like right now? My, my situation is fine. I've still got two and a half years left there, really, so I'll go back. Whether TC or, or Weaves, uh, Steve Weaver, the assistant, will be there, I, I hope they will and stuff. If a new manager comes in, that they stay on. But my situation will pretty much be the same. I'm, I've gone to get, come here to get experience and, I, and I'm getting that. So when I go back, I expect to be part of the first team, really. How many of the uh, Doherty clan will be coming over from Dublin to, to Glasgow for next weekend to, to go to Hamden Park? Uh, nobody. None? Nah, no, Why not? Because, uh, nah, it's on TV, so they'll, they'll just watch it on TV. Like. My dad might do because it's a semi-final, he hasn't said it yet, but he might do, we'll see.